Hello everybody, I'm back again. Just wanted to do a quick video to show this journal that I just finished. Just hope the lighting's good. God knows I struggle with that. I need to purchase some some lamps, but anyways, well, big lamp. But anyways, this is the journal I just finished. It's another vintage. And this is how I decorated the back. I mean the back, the front. I have a little butterfly. This is a uh, applique and just different types of lace. And then this little piece called me. I just wanted to be in the book, so I just put it there. It's a little on the chunky side. And this is the back. So here we go. Let's get started. I use some of this, um, I don't know what it's called, but some of this <laughs> for the closure. And it's a um, clasp envelope cover. So this is my first page. I used um, one of those large envelopes for like uh, birthday cards. Cut it in half, made it, made it into a tuck. And then I have this beautiful image. And I backed her on um, another um, different size envelope and just fold it up to create a little tuck. So you'll see a couple of those throughout the book. And that just tucks back there. On this side, I did a large um, tag. And this image came from Tsunami Rose, one of her um, images. I just tore up and used it in a few of these tags and then I also put a piece of a uh, book page so I like how that turned out and that just pops back there then here I just have one of these uh, journaling cards and this is also from uh, Tsunami Rose this is a piece that was left over from that uh, journal I just made um, Life of Bloom. I didn't use it, so I just glued it there and then added this flower also from Tsunami Rose. So I thought that looked cute. I hope you guys can see it good. And then here I did some pockets, but I used um, some paper collection that I had. Um, but I can't remember the name. But if anybody wants to know, just let me know. But um, I did some pockets with a paper collection, and then I added a little bit of a of a collage in there. I like how that turned out. And then this one is um, from Tsunami Rose. She has a um, a Femme kit just um, postcards. So that's where this came from. And there's my son. Mom. Oh, hi, mom. And can we have ice cream? Okay. Only one. Okay, close the door. And then this one here, and this is from Prima. And then on this side, I have another large tag that I made. On this one, I just added some of the collection paper. But I like how this looks. I just, I guess, wanted to be, do a little different than just my book page um, pocket. So I like that, that look. And here, of course, I have to have my pockets. So I have this one, little journaling card, and here's another tag I made using the that uh, image I tore apart from Tsunami Rose. And I just text back there and I just did a little bit of a little flower, a little lace, some eyelash trim. And this was a piece I had uh, there from another paper collection. And it's just been sitting there. This was gifted to me and I can't remember who I'm trying to say. It's from Wally over at Junk Journal Junkies. And then here's another one of these pockets using the paper collection. And I just have this one. I think this came from... Uh, Pinterest and then the, another card I made or tag I made 
And that's using one of my new stamp sets I just got. Which, by the way, I don't know if you guys know about the app, um, Wish app, which, by the way, I'm not promoting for them or anything, but I'm letting you guys know because I know buying, you know, stamps and, you know, craft stuff is very expensive. But I've been playing with them and I've made a couple of purchases. And like this one, for example... This came from them, and they're like a dollar, two dollars, I think three dollars is the most I paid, and you just pay two dollars shipping, and I think they come from China, so they take a little bit longer than, you know, than any other purchase you make, but I mean, that's cheap, and I also bought some, um, Some die cuts that I got there for uh, 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 open it. Sorry, guys. Okay, last time. Okay, mommy's filming a, a video. Here, go. Go watch cartoons. Sorry, sorry. I know I'm supposed to be showing this journal, but I wanted to show you guys. Look at these. How cute. Some of them are free. You just pay for shipping. And some of them are a dollar. And I tried them. They work. Look, I haven't tried this one yet. Little flowers. I tried that one. You'll see a piece in here that I used. I just cut a piece just to see how it would come out. And it's pretty. This one also looks like a, for labels. And this one is like a little doily. I cut one out. And, I mean, they work good for a dollar, or some of them are free. You just pay for shipping, like I said, two dollars. I'm like, wow. I go, do people know about this? <laughs> There's a lot of stuff. Kitchen stuff, craft stuff, uh, even for your, for your, what do you call those? Your traveler's notebooks. All kinds, I mean, anything. Clothes, um, drawing, notebooks, anything you can think of. Just download the app, and you guys will see. And it's so cheap and they work. I thought for a dollar they probably don't work or for free. They do. Stickers, I mean like anything you can think of. So I thought I'd throw that in there. I'm not promoting for them or anything like that. But, you know, I, I some of us, and I'm including myself, you know, I don't work. You know, when I purchase stuff, it's whatever money I make out of my books. And, you know, because I don't want to bug hubby, but I do. Just don't tell him. But anyways... <laughs> Um, it's cheap, you know, so a lot of us don't have that money to, you know, buy expensive stuff and it's cheap. It's work. It works and they're, they're nice. I mean, I, I don't see my other, but look at that. I mean, here's another one. I just got this not too long ago and I don't know if I paid $2 for this one or three, but they step good. Like, wow. You know? There was another one I wanted to show you guys, and I don't see it, but I, I'm kind of working on another book, so I kind of got a little bit of a mess going on in here. But yeah, you guys should check it out. Okay, go back to the book, Patty. This was in here. <laughs> Sorry, guys. It's just, you know, I just want to share that with you guys, just like with the the uh, free print. I mean, we got to look out for each other and let us let each other know, you know, when there's deals out there. So, yeah, I just had to share. These little stickers, it was like three or four pages. I got for a dollar at also there. Um, I think I, yeah, I think everything pretty much that you buy, it's always $2 shipping. But uh, that's not bad. And there's like three sheets of, of stickers, which I use a lot of them throughout this book. And they're cute, you know, and they're supposed to be for your traveler's notebook. It's from Tsunami Rose. This little clock, I'm not sure where I got it from, but I just did a, put a little flower in the center. <coughs> Excuse me. Here's an, a little side tuck that I made out of a book page. Another one of Tsunami Rose's, um, <coughs> sorry guys, I'm still getting over this flu and I think it's turning into a cough, cold. So, excuse me, sorry. I got all excited with the Wish app. That's why. Sorry. 
yeah this is from tsunami rose and all of them i backed them up with uh file folders just to make them more sturdy and then this one here from prima then here i got another image again this one also i backed her up in a uh, envelope and used it as a tuck so i got two of these uh kaiser craft um cards in there i didn't really put anything on the bottom because i didn't want it to be bulky let's see here's another cute little sticker from that set which i want to order another one for my actual um traveler's notebook and then this one here I did a little bit of collaging and then here as well and then in here I just have this beautiful image from Tsunami Rose Oops, court. and then just this for extra journaling here I have one of my little envelopes and I just did a little bit of collaging and here's a stamp tag a stamp tag and this is from Tsunami Rose and then on the inside little journaling card another one of those little stickers from that kit or that sticker, sticker sheet another journaling card in here and another one of those stickers and here I just added this little cute butterfly and that's from uh, um, a die cut I just I don't know if you guys could see but I added some stickle on it some stickles on it just to make it pop a little bit here's another one of those little stickers and here's that uh, that uh, mason jar I showed you guys. How cute is that? So I'm still playing with it, trying to make ideas on how to decorate them and use them in my books. So I've been playing with those. And then this one here. Another little sticker there. Here's another one of my pockets with one of those little rosette flowers. I have these two little journaling cards from Kaiser Craft on the front. Oh, this is the one I was, I used that die. Oops. How cute is that? Look at that. That's that die that, this one, but I had to cut it so it would fit. But how cute is that? I'm using it as to hold a tag. So I want to use that also on the side of my pages to use it as text but isn't that so cute like wow like I really like that die to go in there see if I, I could find some more but yeah that's cute I like it if you guys could talk you guys would probably say the same thing <laughs> oh I took the paper clip out of here I'm like where is this out here pop that back in there here's another one beautiful image and again in a envelope and this one I did decorate a little more this one I, I don't know where I printed it from but I had it in my stash I've been pulling all my stuff and trying to uh, make embellishments make something out of it if not I need to toss them because I have so much boxes with this with that I don't even know what I have anymore this tag here and this one and I think that's from Kaiser Craft. And then just a little flower I made. Here's another. These were gifted to me. These little flower, I mean butterfly stickers. From um, Crystal. On YouTube, Crystal Designs. She gifted those to me. Those are so cute, which I already... Oh my god. Oh, I thought it was good. Actually, yeah, I did get a little bit of glue. Oops, I should have removed the tag before I glued that flower. But this is from Prima. That just tucks back there. And then on the pocket, I have another. I think this one's from Kaiser Craft. 
And then another card I just stamped on. Or tag I stamped on. And then this one here. Another little bit of collaging there. And here I just stamped a uh, little stamping. And then here from Prima. And Tsunami Rose. So pretty. Love roses. And then I have this beautiful image with one of those little flowers that came in that little sticker sheet. And then I just added a, a little bit of lace there. Here I like the way that pocket looked. Just cut a, I guess, uh, use my uh, craft scissors to just cut it and used, uh, made little pockets out of it. Forgive me if I don't make sense, guys. I'm still sick. Here's a, another little collage, and this one is from a Farmer's Vintage Garden. And then on this side, I have another journaling card from Prima. Then here is, again, another one of those little mason jars. So cute. I think that was my favorite with the butterfly. And then I just made a tag. A large tag to go in the back. And here I just have another beautiful image. Here's another little flower with one of those stickers. <laughs> uh, another one of those postcards from Tsunami Rose. And from Prima. And the other side of that paper bag just have a little journaling card it says today another one of those little stickers and here I have another envelope that I used to create a, a <clears throat> pocket for this image you just got a little bit of a butterfly there with a button and then here just a little journaling card Thought that came out cute and I've been doing stuff like this just to have more space for journaling because I do add too much and really don't leave any space for journaling <laughs> excuse me and then this is another tag from Tsunami Rose I mean postcard from Tsunami Rose this I love the way it came out this is one of the things I made using my scraps that I've been going through in my stuff this little this is supposed to be like a, a journaling well, I mean a tag and it had a I think it was a little bird or a butterfly cut out but I covered it with this image that I had also I'm not sure where I got that one from but I you know I decorated and I put it in the belly band and how cute is that I thought that looked cute so I gotta keep playing with my my junk that I have <laughs> tsunami rose of course I need to print some more of those I have none it's my last one I love those telegrams Here's another, fit no more, another pocket with a little bit of uh, collaging there. have two of these journaling cards. And here's another large tag, which I'm losing my ribbon. Another large tag I made. Some more of this paper. This side, this is another piece I made. I just did a little bit of collaging there with some of this fabric. And uh, some of this lace and some um, eyelash trim and just a little flower and I just used it as a tuck and added this tag from Prima another little sticker there's another little sticker in the back I mean in the top another uh, postcard from Tsunami Rose and here this is also another little tag that I just collage stuff into it and used it as a tuck um, another one of my little pockets I've been making lately just a little butterfly but one on top of the other one just added this lace here and then I added this um, journaling card from Prima and then this one I think this one's from Kaiser Crab I think and then it's open in the back here but I didn't put anything in there 
And then here's another one of my little side tucks there. Put a little bingo card, butterfly. And here's a postcard from Tsunami Rose. And then from Prima. Oh, I thought it was glue. Right, that's on the paper. And there's another little sticker. And then here I have another one of my little pockets. And I just did a little bit of collage in there. This is just a journaling tag, says remember. And this one, I've had it for a while. I found it in my stuff. So I don't know if it, this one's from Tsunami Rose or from somewhere on Pinterest, I don't know. And then here I just have a plain tag. And then here, have another little sticker there and here's another envelope I use for a picture and on this one I just added a piece of lace and some little bling there and uh, added some trim it says love you always and I just added these two pieces and then I have one of my envelopes just did a little bit of collaging there um, a journaling card and another tag I made. And then on the inside I have another journaling card. I guess whichever one, side you want to put it on. <laughs> and this is the end of my book. Another one of my pockets. This is another little piece I put together with all the stuff I've been Collecting I guess from leftover projects, so hopefully I can do more <clears throat> more of, um, Not ephemera more uh, More embellishments with it if not I'm tossing it because I'm tired of having all these boxes And not to mention my husband calls me the box lady He's Like you're a bag lady, but you're more of a box lady than a bag lady. I love boxes. What can I say? They hold all my stuff. <laughs> uh, but anyways, that's the end. Which I just noticed I haven't signed this book. But this is it. This will be on sale on my Etsy as soon as I get a chance to go post it up. But I just wanted to share it real quick. Thank you so much for stopping by, guys. You guys have any questions, let me know. You guys have a blessed day. God bless. Bye-bye.